Hello and welcome back to Planet Zoo. We're finally back in our sandbox zoo. And it's still crowded because everyone wants to see the beavers. Oh, actually people have dispersed a bit. Good. Good. <laughs> it's no more 10,000 people stuck to the beaver habitat. So, um, yeah, I'm not done building this, obviously. As you can tell, there's um a lot of plants missing. The interior still looks like, um, you know, it looks bad, <laughs> to say the least. But at least the beavers are happy. So yeah, today we're going to be building that. Well, I'll, I'll try to. I, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> um, and yeah, let's just start by remembering what plants I need. What do you mean you don't have enough space? You know, this habitat is... Actually small. Yeah, you might not have enough space. Oh my, no. Ow. Um... This is the first time I have ever had not enough space in a habitat. Um, let me just, I guess, go and send two to the storage center. Just to see if they would have enough space with that viewer. Okay. Yeah, the, uh, the habitat is actually kind of too small. Wow. I, yeah. Okay. I'm going to move out some animals. Uh, some distance. That's only four animals, though. That's like not. Um, I mean, maybe, maybe it's for the better. <laughs> I don't have too many animals in every single habitat. I, I did want to have some smaller habitats, you know. Um, on that note, I think I've posted it under some other videos as well. But I do plan on making a franchise zoo for you know some different flavor in here. So if there are any themes or ideas you have regarding that i'd be more than willing to hear them because um honestly <laughs> giant european zoo is my standard layout and while it's really funny at some point it does get a bit boring <laughs> so yeah if, if you have any suggestions feel free to throw them at me um, so i'm just gonna go ahead and just work in some leaves here because um, I actually don't want to put too many plants in this habitat, but I don't want it to look empty. So I think that's going to be the best approach to that. No, I don't like these bushes. No, they they don't fit in. No, maybe some white flowers. Maybe I could just add way more flowers. Maybe that is going to make me feel a bit better about this place. If I just add like all the flowers, they have gonna make me happier. Not knowing myself, that might actually work. I don't know why I'm going with so much white here, just I guess it works with the bushes and all that. Whee! Flowers! Yay! Here, yeah, I have some more. I'm just trying to, you know, fill up the, 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 the inevitable empty space that you get with habitats like this. No, no, don't do that. Why, why are you doing this, Planet Zoo? Why are you hurting me? Oh, look at the beaver! So cute, hello! Why are you hungry? You, this is... you shouldn't be able to be hungry in the zoo. Why are you hungry? This is a crime. I just have to make sure that I'm not stealing all their space, but I think they're okay with these plants. Like, they're not actually taking away space. Are they? No. Okay, that's good, because that would be an issue. Is that we don't have enough space because I'm a dum-dum. And I can't build properly, apparently. Um, no, I just made the mistake of not checking beforehand. Plus, I guess with the, like, large water source inside, that also takes away quite some space. Okay, that's um, that's cute. We need stones, and uh, you know, because <laughs> there is a lake. How could I ever build a lake without rocks around it? Wait, are these tiger rocks? No, these are tough. They look so similar. Um, here you go. Have rock. Maybe that'll give you more movement space, so I can place more plants. How does that sound? <laughs> yep. No. No. Come here. Uh, anyways, I hope all of you, you know, had some nice time over the last few days. 
whether you were celebrating or not, or whether you, I don't know, had to stay with your family. Um, or visited someone or got stuck in a snowstorm. Uh, I hope it was fun. I mean, snowstorms aren't that much fun, but, you know, make the best of it, I guess. Um, yeah, I'll probably be starting the new year with some more streams now that I have the time and the internet connection <laughs> to actually um, manage to stream. So I don't know if I'll be uploading the streams here as well, but knowing myself I probably will because it's not that much extra work since um, Twitch does record them for you. But if you're interested, uh, feel free to check out my Twitch channel. I think I have it linked in my bio. Yeah, <laughs> I think it's up there somewhere. I'll also just put it in um, this video's comment section so you can check that out. If you feel like watching me fail in real time, uh, I'm pretty good at that. Okay, we need more stones over there because that looks sad. No, no, no. Um, let's about this one. So, yeah, regarding the fact that there's um a new European pack that I still kind of have to meddle in somewhere, um, we have free space up here. So I think I'm going to put those animals around here. I know that I originally wanted to put the other, um, the other American animals up there, but, um, <laughs> Planet Zoo said no. <laughs> the devs were like, no. We, we'll now make you actually plan this because now you have animals and now you have to do this um so yeah on that note let me decorate this place in here because it looks freaking sad uh first of all obviously we need wallflower the best thing to happen in this game and i will not leave without them mostly because they let me decorate the interior without me having to do anything it's just like collect flowers woohoo place looks great yay let's move on um but yeah it does help a lot because i don't have to worry about making it look quite that aesthetically pleasing because i honestly don't know how i'm going to make this aesthetically pleasing because it's like a, a pool of water that i can fill with plants i suppose um for the animals to swim in which is cute and all, but, you know. Let's do this. That looks very, very unnatural. Perfect. That's all I want for this zoo. I want it to look like a, the most unrealistic zoo anyone could ever think. But like, in a good way, you know, in a Dominic Myers would turn in his grave way. Also, I'm not sure why I used concrete there. It's like literally the ugliest material i could have chosen <laughs> um anyways let's add some of the uh, wait no i think i needed that tiger marker didn't i uh, um, tiger. um i wanted to go and put some aquatic plants in here because we have like you know water it would look a little bit better if there were plants in there probably um, so I'm just gonna add some seaweed. Or, oh, well, underwater eelgrass, I guess. Um, just to fill it up, make it look a little less... Oh, these are big. Oh, cool. Oh, nice. That, yeah, I haven't used these a lot because I haven't built any, like, huge underwater habitats. But it is pretty cool that you can uh, actually, like, have stuff like that just... You know, pop it down and it's there. Um, not sure how I'm feeling about the these these plants here. Are you supposed to be underwater or not? I don't think so. I don't think they're supposed to be underwater. Um, let's also add in some some rocks because I think the rocks shouldn't be too much of an issue, honestly. Like, it's a rock. Live with it. <laughs> I just want the place to look a little less, you know, like artificial. Because I mean, we all know it's artificial. We can at least pretend like this is 100% natural. You know, like, the the pool just grew here. The natural pool in the zoo, right there. That's 100% the truth. Because I think at least now it looks a little less terrible. Is there any lights in there? Oh, oh I know. 
Um, goodness, where were they? Lights. No. Lights. Um, decorative lighting. I have these here. I could just pop them in the walls like regular pool lights. I know that that's not what they are. But I can do it. Do you see those on the outside? No. Um, I have some upstairs as well. It just looks weird, doesn't it? Me trying to figure out how to build. Um, yeah. We could also have like these guys here underwater, but that looks weird as well. Where is my uh, fancy underwater lightning? I, mean, I know that it doesn't exist, but I can hope for it, right? I mean, that's these lights are cute, but I don't think they fit the the theme of the zoo. European fairy lights. It's very Christmassy. <laughs> um. Um. Yeah, for some reason these work better. I don't know. They give me like aquarium feels. Yeah, no, always on, please. That's something I'll have to set for this building. No, 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 no. Please go in the other direction. Uh, I'll have to set all the lights in this building on always on, because otherwise I'll be saddened by permanent darkness. Um, especially in the water. I'm not sure if I prefer it like this or with the lights hidden in the ground. Can you actually see anything? Like, is there anything visible? In Do the lamps work? Because it doesn't look like it. It looks like they're just there on the sides. Um, and the game pretends like they work. Can I? Can I? Thanks. So let me just undo the position snap thingy because it's annoying. What if I put them underground? Because that's what I was planning on doing, right? Just have them floating in the water like this. Um, remove... Please remove the light bulbs and not the whole habitat. Thank you. If I go and copy a couple of the... No, I want the light bulb. Game. <laughs> Why do you hate me so much? You know, and make them be, like, always on, obviously, because otherwise this works. Lens. And then hide them like pearls, kind of? Like light pearls? Can you please glow? Oh, it's glowing already. Okay, it just looks weird even though it's supposed to be glowing. There, I guess. Are you also glowing? <laughs> it's hard to tell underwater because it seems like, I don't know, either the light engine doesn't like me or I'm doing something wrong. Can I please flick on you? Hello, little ball. Let me... Ball ball. The plant is in the way. Fine. I guess you don't get to glow. Be happy. Not glowing. Um. Beavers. I'm just beavers. I'm I'm trying to find the beaver so that I can. Why does this not have a search feature? Like, give me a search feature. North American beaver. Okay. So I need to go to N. Like, at this point, there's so many options. Yeah, I just want the search feature. Um, see, I was thinking they had something that I could put in here. Water feeder. Or a, 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 a rubber duck. It could then float upwards. Also, one of these things, I I don't know if I like that or not, but can you please, thank you, goodness. Um, is there, is there, oh wait, the rubber duck, oh that's fine. Uh, step number three, replace these with something else, because I can at least change the colour, but I think all the colours are kind of, what about like a nice teal blue? Where is my, oh there, like that. I guess it still kind of looks like grey, but like a slightly less, you know, depressed grey. Um, but it's still grey. Oh, what is the window doing there? <laughs> what does everything hate me today? Uh, but I think the blue works out 
pretty well. Like, I don't want to, you know, completely ruin the color scheme of this place. Okay, let's, let's actually watch a beaver hopefully climb up there and into the water. The thing we have all waited for. Swimming beaver. Okay, no, I don't need to... No. Oh, go back. I don't want the platform here. It's, it's in the way. And the beavers have, like, no space. Can I, can I please click the beaver? I just want to stalk it. There, it's a, a somewhat happy beaver. In its somewhat happy habitat. Swimming somewhat happily, I think. Do you want to play with your rubber ducky? Go on. Go play with your rubber ducky. Yes. Say hello to the... Oh, wait. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is why I built these habitat. Just to watch something interact with a rubber duck. That's that's the only purpose of my life. Rubber ducks, genuinely. Um, just because this place looks kind of not so happy. Let's put some. Where are my blind? Yeah. Some crow bush. Because I don't like the way this place looks kind of dead on the inside. And, you know, plants always help with that. And, of course, also stuff like actual bedding. Because <laughs> this is technically speaking there. Wait, do you have a pool? Did I not give you a pool? There is a beaver pool toy and I didn't use it. Okay, um. I think it looks kind of cool if I place it here. You know, like in the in the bushes kind of. Can I Can I lower it a bit? So, I need to move the rock up. The, the rock is actually the way to get in there, man. <laughs> um, and let's give them some toys while I'm at... What do you mean, obstruct? It's the game always obstructing me. The ball and the water energy. Yeah. Um, They have toys now and they have a pool. There's only four of them because the habitat is small and I'm stupid, but okay. Um... I still don't like the interior design. Let's try to work some rocks in. In hopes of that fixing anything, even though it won't fix it at all, because it'll still look stupid. Um. I don't know if there's a way to make this here look less... You know. You know. That's bad. Um, I could use like these here, but maybe glass? What are I using here? What are these? These are wall panels. So if I go here and I pick like panel, there are wooden panels that, that look kind of okay ish. There are snow. <laughs> okay, I want snow. Stone brick. There are opaque glass panels and like glass house glass panels. That might work. Like if I click on here, yeah. Okay, but I'd have to, you know, do that do the painful thing where I rebuild this with glass panels. But I can do that because I built this before. I just need to be careful. Just go with it. No. Um, how do I move down over here? You always have to figure out what you want to move and where you want to move it. Um, and let's remove that. Move this up a bit. Wait, this is new. Can you... Did you just see this? I didn't have to wiggle it around. Oh my god, it moved naturally. Can I... Can I please zoom in, game? Please let me zoom. <laughs> no. I, I have to... I really have to stop doing this before the roof is finished. Like genuinely, it's 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 a bad idea to wait to not finish this before I have a roof. Okay. And then I need to take one of these and copy it and put it here and turn it around carefully because there's the roof. We don't want that. And then no no no. Why did I do that? Why am I so stupid sometimes? Down. You know, you'd think after like building for 
50,000 hours, I wouldn't misclick anymore, but I still do. Like right now, where I can't click the other platform. We can. The wrong one? Yep. And then I need to replace the middle platform with a 2x2 two two panel. Couldn't be impossible. Um, there we go. Okay. But, um... Now I just need to see whether they can walk on that or not. I think it'll definitely look better that way. Because it's, you know, glass. <laughs> Reversible area. Yeah, they can go up there and they can go in the water. Okay. I think it's a bit better with the glass panel. It, it looks a lot less like it's going to be like a, a very, very terrible place for animals to stay. <laughs> I don't know why, but for some reason this this particular indoor habitat just looks bad. Um, like I normally don't like indoor habitats all that much to begin with, but this one I just really can't stand. Uh, so I'm going to do what everyone does when they don't like something. I'm going to add a shit ton of lights. That are permanently on and forever glowing. And it's going to look really weird, but who cares? Does it fit my theme of this zoo? No. Is it glowing? Yes. You know what? It could be worse. It could be worse. It looks good from the outside. <laughs> That's what matters, right? Um. Why are these still over there? What are you doing there? Go away. Um. So yeah. Next, I'm going to do something for the the new animals that we now have. I haven't checked, and I don't think I can put them in habitats together. Like. No, can't put anything together. I mean, I was kind of hoping that maybe the fallow deer and um, the where are they? Seriously, <laughs> where are they? The, the ibex would kind of work together, but they won't. Um, so I guess I'll be turning this into habitats, but I'm not not sure how I'm going. You know, I had a plan. And then this new DLC came along and screwed up my plan. <laughs> um, so now I have to think again. I could also just take this space that was actually, you know, like um, a cleanup space and put animals in there. Or... Hmm. Hmm. Thinking is difficult. <laughs> uh, I'll probably come up with something. Because... This is very, very small, and I have a very, very big area to cover. I did want to raise some areas around here. Mm, I might do that and put the remaining European animal, but I can't put a mountain here because it's in the middle of everything. But put a mountain there. Um, but, uh, I forgot what American animals I'm missing. I am very, very confused. Continent, North America. Okay, not you. Bisons. I, bisons I don't have. So I need a habitat for the bisons and the longhorn antelopes. Um, moose I have. Grizzlies I don't have. So I need a habitat for grizzlies. I need a habitat for the cougar. And the arctic wolf I'm putting with the snow animals. So um, I want to put the alligator with the reptiles, but... I'm not doing a reptile house because I already have reptiles here. So I guess that's the three animals we'll need. So I'll be doing alligators here along this river strip. Um, I think. And like do sort of a of a garden area here because I don't like curved. Mm, what could I do for the bears and the cougars though? Like I'm putting them here on this corner, obviously. Thinking, you know, it's 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 difficult. I have to do it. Uh, whatever. I'll come up with something. Um. Until then, I hope you enjoyed this short episode of me trying to freak out because, well, trying to build and then freaking out because I can't. And uh, yeah, I hope I'll see you again soon. Whenever I have an idea of what I'm doing with this, you know. <laughs> so yeah, bye.